guys and welcome to another plan with me. Again, my name is April and this is Pugged and Crafty. This week I'm going to be planning for the week of July 2nd to July 8th, which is the 4th of July week and I'm super excited. This week I'm using a kit from Shop Jessica Hearts. It is called Americana and I purchased this kit um, during the Planner Boss Collective. Um, it is a matte kit and it's absolutely beautiful. I had a really hard time deciding which kit I was going to use. I ended up with three 4th of July kits, um, but I decided to go with this one because it was the most 4th of July um, as far as the ones that I really liked. Um, the other one that you'll, that I was really struggling to choose between, I will use later this summer um, just because it, it can work for summer, which is nice. So let me flip through the pages really quick so you can see. These are our full boxes. Um, this is my glitter headers and checklists and flags and quarter boxes. And we've got functionals um, here with the checklist, date covers, um, some cute little icons here, movie marquee, dinners, exercise, work, family, school, spending to clean in next week. Half boxes and headers and weekend banner. Little things, functional icons, bill dues, quarter boxes, appointment labels, um, full heart check, ombre heart checklists. Um, washi, um, so bottom washi and washi strips. I did go ahead and cut my bottom washi because I'm going to be using, um, in addition to this kit, I'm going to be using my red, white, and blue washi from Simply Gilded because it is beautiful and I couldn't resist. So I'm going to do what I can to incorporate as much of this into the kit as I can. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and set this aside. And then, of course, um, what's a kit or a week? without having one of the beautiful pen gems pens. This is called um, London Calling. Um, this was a collaboration earlier in the year, or not a collaboration, but it was a release earlier in the year. Um, City Pop, I believe is what it was called. Uh, this is silver hardware and it's got a pretty um, kind of like blue iridescent tip here, as you can see. Uh, really pretty. I don't have Liberty, so I don't get to use that one this week. All right, let's go ahead and get started. I did go ahead and mark my boxes um, as far as which full boxes I'm going to use. Oh, and I've got a couple of these cute bows from Simply Guild as well. Um, I'd like to incorporate these into my spread. All right, so let me go ahead and um, zoom you guys in. I'm going to set everything off to the side and, whoops, wrong way. There we go. Okay, perfect. So for my full box um, here in the, um, what's it called? There we go, the quote box that we're going to use the Bold Stripes, Bright Stars, and Brave Hearts. Okay, perfect. And then um, I'm going to wait to lay that down because I'm going to do my bottom washi first because I learned my lesson. <laughs> bottom washi first. Work your way from the bottom up. Um, I'm going to use the bottom half of this washi. Oops, and the whole thing came off. There we go. Do you guys have plans for the 4th of July? Unfortunately, I get to work, so no plans as far as fireworks or anything like that. Um, I don't mind. I know it's going to be pretty busy. Um, I didn't work 4th of July last year, um, but I heard the horror stories. Um, I understand that most of it's really going to be dealing with um, dogs who broke out because of the fireworks. Um, which means dealing with stray dogs. Um, dogs who potentially got injured trying to jump through their fences or over their fences or any of that um, so it's kind of sad um, but I'm prepared um, it is the second busiest holiday Memorial Day and 4th of July I believe are the busiest holidays from what I've been told and I survived Memorial Day so what can I say all right and I think I'm gonna use the red simply gilded down here some uh, just because it's got a lot of blue in it so let me grab my white out here so that I can get rid of that line. Where did I throw it? Uh-oh, I thought I had everything. My bad. There it is right over here. Okay. So let me go ahead and wipe this out really quick. 
And I'm hoping that I can get through this plan with me <laughs> um, without having to stop. Um, other than, you know, when I put down my headers, of course. Um, without being interrupted by the dog because she's gotten into something or because my boyfriend has come home. He's out running a couple of errands. I just got home from running some errands. Um, I got my hair cut. Um, I splurged on a pedicure because it's been a while. Um, and then... Before all of that, I went to lunch with one of my friends from work, um, and I indulged in an adult beverage or two, so which was nice. And then, of course, I had to do adulting things and go get some chicken feed because I ran out yesterday. <clears throat> We're having a squirrel pump, so the squirrels, I think, are eating just as much of the feed as the chickens are unfortunately and it's driving me crazy that I'm having to buy it a lot more frequently. Um, winter is really bad too because the squirrels come out and try to get their food in the winter a lot as well. Um, but all things considered I can't really complain it's not like the feed is that expensive even though it's organic um, and I thankfully don't have to buy it that often um, just once every couple of months so if I'm feeding the squirrels I'm feeding the squirrels. Um, the poor chickens aren't dealing too well with the heat, unfortunately. Um, one of the girls in particular really struggles with the heat. Um, so I make sure that they have plenty of water. Um, they still lay during the summer, so I can't really complain about that. It's the winter time that they kind of um, slow down with their um, egg laying production. So... Alright guys, I just laid down my bottom washes. So I'm going to go ahead and put my full boxes in here real quick. Um, I'm going to start with the bottom row. And then once I have the bottom row laid down, I will probably go back and do my headers. Just so I can get those in. And then um, kind of go from there. I will, I haven't decided if I'm just going to stop this all together or if I'm just going to fast forward through it. Um, I might fast forward and I don't know what the heck happened there. I had to... On last week's spread, um, I moved a label so there's some sticky residue and I'm wondering if I accidentally transferred some of it. Um, that would be my luck. Uh, I'm sure there'll be plenty of stuff to cover it up there so I can't complain. Alright, so for the headers, I decided that I'm going to do, I'll probably start with dark red, light blue, dark blue, light red. Um, so I'm going to put this one, let's see, one, two, red, red, red. So this will be dark blue, right? Because red, light blue, light blue, hang on, dark red, light blue, dark blue, you know what, let me just do this, alright, red, I'll try to go as fast as I can. I'm not really good at putting these things down fast, unfortunately. Um, I haven't mastered that ability, but in time, I'm sure I will get there. Um, make sure I'm in frame here. That's half the battle, especially when I'm off to the left and my LCD screen is on the right. Um, sorry, that's my dog. She's scratching at the front door even though I know she doesn't need to go out because I just took her out so she just needs to chill out so she did all of her potty business thank goodness oh, that's crooked I haven't decided if I'm going to use the date covers I do have them in this kit um, but I'm not sure oh and then I may or may not I have some I'll show you in a second some covers for the, oh, I was doing, am I doing this right? One, two, three, yeah, okay. Sorry, you guys. Had a moment. Um, anyway, so what I was saying was I'm thinking about using, I have some covers for the headers here that I may or may not use from some um, Rose Colored Days. So what you do is you take these, um, 
and you lay them over to add some sparkle and flair. I just think it's super cute. I want to add as much um, silver foil into the kit as I can since it's 4th of July and this kit isn't a foiled kit. So whatever I can do to make it sparkle, by golly, that's what I want to do. So, um, I'll do what I can. I haven't decided, like I said, just because it's so tedious and doing the overlay is kind of a pain in the butt. But we'll see. I do have some other overlays for the full boxes. Um, I will probably end up buying some more. I really like them. I haven't used them yet, but I have seen other planners use them and I love the way they look. Um, I'm missing, hold on, I gotta open this up so I can see where I'm at. Light, yeah, okay. Ember! Sorry, my dog is really scratching at the front door and I don't know why. I literally just came back in with her before I started filming, so she has no reason to go outside. Um, I really don't want to put her in a crate because she just spent a lot of time in her crate. I wonder if maybe I should give her a chewy. And here I was hoping I was going to make it through this video without having to stop it. Go figure. I don't think that's going to be the case this week, you guys. Um, thank goodness for the ability to slice and splice and all that fun stuff. One, two, three, four. Okay. I want to make sure I don't get my color rotation off. <laughs> so I had to count. I'm like, what am I doing? I'm not really good at knowing exactly off the bat. I watched some of these planner ladies and I am so impressed with how quickly they can just know right off the bat what color is going to be in each row and so quickly no less. Um, I hope to get there one day. One day. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh you guys. That's not right. Alright. I'll fix it. I'll come back to it. I forgot that I had to do my boxes first. Alright so let me put my I'm going to put this back down. Okay. Again, I love that these are matte. Okay, so that goes there. There. Because I know these are going to come up. So... And here I thought I was pre-planning. I did pre-plan as you can tell. I have my, you know, things written down as far as where I'm going to put my full boxes. I've got my um, list here so I know when my work schedule is and all that fun stuff. So I am prepared per se. I just, I'm still getting accustomed to planning in the air in Condren. This is only my second week in here. Um, so remembering that the boxes aren't exactly the same as they were in the recollections is definitely a learning curve so bear with me thank goodness I have fingernails <laughs> they come up so nicely I love how um, with the matte paper they do really come up um, easily I really appreciate that let me tell you all right so let me so I know what I'm doing I can go ahead and put down the bottom row so let me at least get that on and then do my flag here and so the reason I'm not putting the flag on the 4th of July is because I'm going to use the fireworks since it makes a little bit more sense um, I'm going to use the flag the day before I want a little bit of space between so I'm trying to kind of lay it down nicely there we go alright so one two there we go Hi, puggy dog. I see you over there. You gonna come up? All right, you guys. Thank you so much for your patience. Here we go. I got it. I got it. I know someone at one point had said something when they were doing their bottom washi about three dots, but I don't know if that applies to the headers or not. You guys, let me know. Um, cause I'm curious. Alright, so let me see if this is gonna fit right or if I'm gonna have to move that header too. Um, I'm hoping I'll be okay. I don't wanna have to go up any higher. So let me put it down here. I hope my head's not getting in the picture. I'm gonna turn y'all sideways. 
turning you sideways. Yep, I'm gonna have to move it. Dang it. Gotta move it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Oh no, I might have to pull my undo out. Alright, let me put this down first. And then put my header back on top. That's better. Let's see, that's not too bad. I didn't get too far off track, so. Thankfully, it's nice and quiet here today, but oh my gosh, y'all. It is so hot outside. I almost had to ask myself, I'm like, wait a minute, am I in Colorado or am I in Las Vegas? I got in my car after lunch and the car registered that it was 104 degrees outside, you guys. Oh my god. Um, thankfully it's not humid because if I were in Florida I probably would have died. Um, as I went across town it did finally drop down to... That is really high. I'm doing date covers. Okay, it's fine. Um, it dropped down to saying 100 in the car um, according to the the car's thermometer, thermostat, whatever you want to call it. Um, but it's just miserable. Um, I looked on the temperature on my phone and it was said it was 97 today. Um, either way, I'm, I hate it. <laughs> and it's supposed to, like, real time temperature is supposed to be a hundred an eight you guys a hundred and eight what am I supposed to do with that I have to work so I'm gonna be stuck indoors is that the right that's not the right color um, so I'm very very thankful that I'm gonna be inside all right hang on a second red pink all right hang on red light blue light pink goes over this or light whatever you want to call it here we go and I'll fix this hopefully it doesn't stay this hot too long um, I'm really concerned you know I'm not at work today so I don't know what's going on but I can just imagine the poor animals you know like it is undeniably hot out there and people have no qualms about leaving their poor doggies in their car to run errands and it's way too hot for that. Um, so it just makes me really, really sad. I'm like, why do you have a dog? You know, what? what is the point? And we have a lot of people around here that leave their dogs outside. Um, and even in this heat they're out there and I don't know that they're checking to make sure that they have enough water and then it's not evaporating I have to with these temperatures I have to make sure that I check on the chickens um, constantly they have four bowls of water outside you guys I do not want them to get overheated um, so I make sure that they have four bowls um, they prefer drinking out of metal bowls, and so they have the two smaller metal bowls, since that's what they prefer. And I do the small ones because I know they're going to evaporate, and I don't want them to burn themselves. And then I have two large plastic bowls as well, um, so that I don't have to worry about evaporation um, as quickly anyway. I mean, it's still going, going to evaporate, unfortunately. All right, let me see. I think I do still need to move this side up. Oh, what do you know? Yeah, I'm gonna have to move it up. Dang it, dang it, you guys. I don't know if you can hear that, but my dog is huffing and puffing. She likes to get into things. Um, so I do have flags that came with this kit, and I will probably use them because I looked in the um, stash of 
Clever Gal crafts flags that I have because, like I said, I wanted something foiled and I didn't have anything that really goes well. I do have a light blue, but um, I wasn't really keen on it. Unfortunately, I don't have any of the Rose Colored Days flag overlays, so they'll just have to be plain and that's okay. Okay, you guys, I hope that was recording, but um, I'm going to go ahead and do my sidebar here. I think that's where I was at, and like I mentioned before, I want to incorporate as much of my washi as I can, so I'm going to pull some of the blue Simply Gilded. This is the 10mm? Uh, uh, I can't remember the size this year, so bear with me. Let me find the starting point. Here it is. All right, and we will put some of that down. I want to try to have a little bit more white space than I normally do, so... I'm um, going to space it out a little bit. My puggy dog is trying to get up in my lap. <laughs> and she's bumping me right now. Let me let her up here really quick. Come here, pretty girl. Come on, Miss Miss. And I know my battery is fully charged, so I know that's not why my um, camera turned off. And I made sure to erase my memory card, so I know it's not full. Puggy's giving me kisses, so if I sound muffled, it's all her fault. We'll blame her. Okay, there we go. So that's on. So let me go ahead and pull out my habit trackers. And as always, every week I track two things. Uh, the first thing I track is my water consumption because I need to make sure that I get 50 ounces of water in me um, as often as I possibly can. Sorry that the camera's bouncing. There we go. Um, especially in these heats, uh, this heat here that we're having. Um... I might move it up a little bit. Thank you, Puggy. Thank you, Puggy. Okay. She is trying to give me all the kisses. I'm going to move it up. There we go. Okay. So, and then put my habit tracker down. Amber Rose. There's one. Some water. And then I want to make sure that I have enough space. Um, because I want to use a girl here. Let me grab it out. Sorry. Um, from Mellow Paper Studios. It from last week's kit, but I didn't. I wasn't able to use it last week because I didn't give myself enough space. So hold on just a second here. Let me pull it out. Um, it's the Hydrate Girl because she is too cute, and that's why I wanted to use the washi there so I can make sure that I have enough space. There we go. So there is my hydrate sticker. And then next I've got my, um, making sure that I remember to take my medicine every day. And I don't have a sticker for that. Not yet anyway. One of these days I'll order one. Okay, so there's that. And then I'm going to use, let me see how the white washi looks. I'm afraid it might be too white. White on white. What do we think? With the bows, I think it should be okay, right? I got this. Okay. Go ahead and put that down. Gotta make it sparkle, you guys. Gotta make it sparkle. There we go. Okay. And then um, the next thing that I want to put down... Oh, the puggy dog. Um, is a small to-do list. Sorry, I gotta put something in here because this is sticking. Um, a small to-do list, so let me see if I have some three heart checklists. Um, if not, I will just make one. And I don't see one. Okay, so let me grab a piece of blue washi here. And put to-do... Love this weekly to do. And then I will use, I think, a faded red checklist. So I need one, two, three. Three of them because there are three things that I do every week. Um, or daily, rather. It's not weekly, it's daily. I guess we don't have a. I don't, yeah, I do have it to do. Maybe I'll change it. Give me a second here. Let me cut this first. 
one thing at a time, right? Get my ducks in a row and all that. Um, I, this is the slice tool. Um, I bought it on Amazon, but you can get a similar product. Come on. There you go. You can get a similar product from Michael's. From what I've told him, it's gray. Um, and it does the same thing. What I like about this one in particular is it has a small blade. I do. Oh my goodness. My dog needs to go outside, you guys. Give me just a second here. Um, I'll be right back. Alright you guys, sorry about that. I am back. Doggy is out. Changed my title here to to do. There we go. And then we are going to do three hearts. There. Perfect. And then I'll do blue washi strip again. Oh, that is crooked, you guys. Hold on. I don't know if I cut it crooked. If I laid it down crooked. Let me see. There we go. That's better. Okay. Good enough, y'all. Good enough, right? Seeing if I lay this down just right, nobody will know. And then, all right, so I finally got, have another three day weekend or three day break coming up um, in a couple of weeks here in July. Um, it's the, what is it, 22nd, let me look here. Uh, so the 22nd through the 28th is my work schedule, not that you can see that, there we go. So I am going to be off. Um, I believe it's the 24th, 25th, and 26th, so I'm super excited, so we might do a little trip here, but I'm really excited about that. I just got that scheduled today, so I'm looking forward to it, um, ready for another little bout of R&R, &R. <laughs> um, and just with as crazy as it's been. Alright, so I've already used all of my pool boxes, yay. Um, and then what else am I going to put here? What did I put? Oh, I tracked my happy mail that I have coming. So maybe I can do that because I do have more happy mail. What else? Okay. Um, and we can do, I think, light blue. Oh, I cut this end off. So let me put this back. Whoops. Cause I always have happy mail coming because I like to spend and with the ultimate planner sale coming up this weekend you guys yeah I'm gonna be doing a little spending all right so I am going to line this up with the bottom here and I don't care if I overlap the washi just a tiny bit there we go okay so I might put a little things right in the middle of the washi. I know I'm covering it up, but that's okay, right? It's still pretty. Okay, so there is my sidebar. Let me zoom out so that you can see it. Um, let me go a little bit more. All right, so there is my sidebar. Um, so I've got my quote, and then I was thinking of, but they're awfully big, so I'm probably not going to use these. What a shame, these things are huge, but they're pretty. It was, it was a thought. So now we're gonna go ahead and go to the day by day. So we're gonna start with Monday. And as always, first and foremost, it's always trash. Um, this week is trash only, no recycles. Um, we have a contract with an, I think it's an outside company, so it's not the city that does it. Um, so they still come no matter what and sorry you guys. Okay, that's what it is in my um, I have a bookmark in my planner. So I was trying to figure out what was causing a weird bump right here um, We have a contract company that comes out and takes care of our trash. So even on a holiday uh, They still come out which is really nice um, Do I have a trash day sticker? All right, I do not have a trash day sticker So I'm going to have to use something else and I think just for fun 
I'm going to use this small little flag here um, from the kit because it's cute. I'm just going to put that right here. And that got so crooked. Um, here there. I was like, I know I have my scissor tweezers nearby. I made sure to have them. So we'll mark that. And then I'm going to use a sticker from Coffee Monsters Co. Um, to mark my trash day. Um, there we go. And then um, I have to work. So I'll mark that down. Puggy's giving me kisses again. Kitty, kitty girl. So I'll use a half box to mark my work schedule. And I will do. I think I want to use this flag because it's cute. Well, I've got a flag on that week, so I'll save it for later in the week. Okay, we'll use this one. So here is for my work schedule. Do I want to see? I'll put it down here because I'll use that for any happy mail that I might have. Um, I don't know if I'm expecting anything on Monday or not, but I know that I have a couple of things that should be shipping any time now. Um, so I want to keep an eye out for those. Alright, and then I'm going to use a work um, foiled header, come on, focus, from Station Stickers. There we go. Um, and this is a silver foil. Um, I have one more sheet of these. and um, You can also get them from Rose Colored Days. I am just out, so um, I need to order more. Lay that down. All right, and then Tuesday I also work, but let's see, on Monday we got trash, I work, um, and then I need to post to Instagram, so let me pull out my Piper Paper Company, where did I put them, that's what I was looking for earlier and couldn't find, I knew there was something amiss. Um, Piper Paper Company um, has a lot of really great functional stickers. If you've never purchased from her shop, I highly recommend it. Um, here we go. And she's got Instagram, she's got cameras, and script stickers, you name it. And then she's got functional icons. This is um, the Planner Boss Collective. I bought a bunch of things from her, so... Um, happy Meal, all of that fun stuff. Okay, so I'm going to use this nice blue here since I already have that. So I will put this up here that I need to post a spread. Um, and I'm not going to put anything on the back end. I'm trying to do a little bit more white spacey um, just because I've noticed that I'm becoming very much a new white space planner. Um, actually, I think I'm going to do a little bit of washi, you guys. Let's put some washi in for some fun, but I'm going to use white. Because honestly, when am I going to use most of this washi again? Am I right? Is that too much? I think it'll be fine, right? It's fine, it's fine. No such thing as too much washi. So much for becoming a white space planner. I want this bad boy to be colorful. Okay, there we go. And then, oh, I changed my mind again, you guys. See, this is, it's so hard. Put you back. Okay, and then I have work, trash, happy meal. And that's it for Monday right now. Um, Tuesday. I work again, so I will do this pretty blue here, and another work header. Uh, 
Uh oh. You guys reading any good books? So I'm on. Still reading the Black Dagger Brotherhood series. I'm almost done with um, the one called The Thief. I don't know what number it is. I've lost count. Um, ooh, and I'm crooked. But I'm literally a chapter or two away from the end. So I'm super excited um, to finish it. I know I just said um a lot. <laughs> I took a speech class in college and that was one of the things they talked about was using um a lot surprisingly I didn't I'm I've never been a big fill word user so it surprises me when I catch myself saying um a lot or you know or saying uh and it's, I wouldn't say it's a pet peeve of mine, but I definitely notice when people say it a whole lot. And I, it's very subconscious for most people. They don't even notice that they're doing it. So I don't, I try not to focus on it too much for people. Alright, so that's really all I have going on for Tuesday. Nothing special. Um, both of us are working. Well, my boyfriend might be off, but I don't put his stuff in my planner unless it affects me. All right, Wednesday is 4th of July, and as I mentioned, I am working. Um, I think I'm going to use the ice cream. Um, I, and again, I just said that again. My What's really nice about my em employer, the office manager, is really good about taking care of the employees that work holidays, so they always do something. Um, the... They do, they'll buy lunch sometimes, or they will ice cream or sodas or candies, or they always do something nice for the folks that are working on the holidays. They also allow you to kind of dress down a little bit. Um, you still have to look somewhat professional. Because we do have a uniform shirt that we wear, but for the holidays, uh, like M Memorial Day, they let people wear red, white, and blue, so you could wear a patriotic shirt. They just, obviously, they don't want you wearing anything offensive, so. Which makes sense, because we don't want to offend our customers. Alright, so on Wednesday, it is also Washi Wednesday. So I pulled out a sticker from once more for from the <laughs> once more with love to annotate washi wednesday i'm getting better at posting every week um but i'm i like using the stickers to annotate so i think i will use this cute little yeah it's a girl i had to look um this little girl she's got a bow in her hair sorry the pug is impeding um, and she is sliding down a roll of washi. Too cute. Alright, so we will put that here to annotate Washi Wednesday. So I know that it's a post on Instagram. And then in addition to Washi Wednesday, it's Independence Day. So let me do my sticker. And I will do, let's do red. Red is really pretty. Yeah, it'll fit. It'll look beautiful. I'm going to put that right up against here to kind of cover up some of the line. And then place that. Oop, she's getting wiggly. Wiggle wiggles. Beautiful. Washi Wednesday, er, happy 4th of July. Here we go, gorgeous. Then, since I'm working, I'm not gonna be able to record, um, so I won't worry about that. No bill due. Give me just a second. Uh, my boyfriend just got home, so there's gonna be a lot of noise. I'll be right back. 
Okay, you guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. All right, so I marked 4th of July, and that is all I have going on for Wednesday because I am working, so no recording. Um, and I will be doing my recording on the 5th. Um, so let me go ahead and mark that. And I pulled out some stickers from um, Once More With Love. And I also have these planning time stickers. Um, so I'm going to use a full box, I think. And I'll do the fireworks. Because that'll be one of the first things that I want to get done if I can. Uh, we'll do this cutie here. And a little one of these. And I'll just write playing with me in here. Okay. So then, I always have an opportunity to go ahead and edit uh, while I'm at it. So I'll use a washi strip again. And we'll just lay this down like this. And this will be my edit reel. And I do have edit script again from Piper Paper Company. Let me find it. And I'll need that too. Okay. So edit and upload. Alright, so these are very, very delicate, so I have to be very careful with them. I hate handwriting anything, because my handwriting is atrocious. There you go, so edit. And then, hopefully that evening I'll be able to do, um, get everything ready for an upload. And I do scheduled upload, but I'm going to go ahead and put it down on Friday, because I don't know if I'll actually be able to get it all done, so I'll come back to that. Um, I have, I want to post to Instagram again, and that's going to be the midweek spread, uh, for Monday through Wednesday for this week that I'm planning right now. And I'll use red. That's my midweek spread. Um, and then I'm going to have to do some laundry. I'm gonna go naked, right? Nobody wants to go naked. All right, so maybe I'll put it on a strip of washi. Maybe, maybe. Oh, I have a piece I already cut out. I already have a piece, so let me do this. Cause I'll know what the laundry basket means. I don't need any kind of crazy script for it. I'll cut that off in a minute. All right, so let's doesn't work as well. It needs to be thinner. So I'll grab one of these and just plunk that right there. So laundry. I'm a little crooked. There we go. Alright. And then, oh you know what? I told myself last time I want to make a checklist instead of doing it this way just because it takes up a lot of space and then I don't ever have room to mark my happy mail or anything else like that all right so let me do that okay we will use a red and I will just cut off a couple of these because I don't need all of them I just need three, so I'm going to use one of the flag checklists, for lack of a better word. That's a little cut crooked, but that's okay. It's all good, right? It's all good. Okay, laundry goes down at the bottom. And then I've got my Instagram to post. Um... 
Mark, what else do I need to do? Midweek spread. And then I have two bills due. So let me... I will just write it. I come back to the laundry basket. I will go ahead and put that there. Alright, and then... Two bill dues. And I can write them both on the same line. Or on the same... Form. I have enough room. There we go. Do it that way. Okay. Thursday, I need another checklist. Or, I'm sorry, Friday, I need another checklist. One, two, three. And I'm going to use a darker blue this time since I used red. And I'm going to put that up here. Okay, so on Friday, also a day off, um, I'm going to do my scheduled upload. So let me grab my script sticker here and my tweezers. So I'm going to put that first. I'm going to put it, yeah, we'll put it here. Upload. Perfect. And then it's also payday. I've got my cute little payday here. Come on, focus. There we go. So cute. This time I'm going to make it work with this washi, you guys. I'm going to do it. Because it's too pretty and I hate wasting it. There we go. A little too far to the left. A little too far to the left. And honestly, all of this could go haywire because my boyfriend is also off on Thursdays, so we might end up doing something, but if that's the case, I'll just annotate it later. Um, since I'm off both of these days, I can just move things around. Not a big deal. I don't know, you guys. I'm not feeling it with the washi in here. Just not feeling it. So I'll use one of these thin strips. And I feel like that needs to be red. I feel like it needs to be not that color. So I will do. Do I have it? Can I get this in red? That, that's not very thin. This will do though. At least it's not solid blue. Okay. That's better. Oh, I love that. Alright, I convinced my boyfriend he needs to figure out dinner, so he bought dinner and he's making dinner. Yay! Okay. That is it for Friday for now. Um, like I said, when I schedule them, I schedule my videos to upload for Sunday at 10 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. Um, so I don't have to worry about that. Saturday, I do work again, so I will use a light red I'm off on Thursday and Friday right Thursday and Friday yeah okay and Saturday I work there we go and work sticker Alright, and then on Saturday, I don't have anything else scheduled at this time, so I'm just going to leave that as it is. On Sunday, I need another three heart checklist. I have a few things that I want to do, so I'm going to use this one, and I'm going to put it right here. There we go. Whoops. And I will do today. I 
And I need to post my before the pen to Instagram. That's okay, right? Yeah, that'll work. Put that there. And then I have to post to my video to two different groups in Facebook. Um, they're local planner groups that I post to. And then I always try to make sure that I post in the group, the Facebook group of the shop designer of the kit that I'm using as well so that people that you that purchase their kits can also take a look at my video um, and then I need another Instagram sticker and we'll use I think this is the same I don't think there's any rhyme or yeah there is okay here we go I couldn't figure out the the rhythm of the stickers okay so two different Instagram posts and then that and the video is live so and then I need a I will probably have to do some cleaning so let me do a cleaning list and I'm not gonna go crazy I just know that the bathroom probably needs to be cleaned Let me do it down here there we go I'm definitely not doing my grocery shopping <laughs> on this day I will do my grocery shopping up here though um, I don't even have a sticker for groceries, but I have my cleaning. Come on, there we go. There's my cleaning to do's. Oh, and look at that, I even have a little, I didn't even notice this before, I've got that little, if it wants to focus, there we go, I have that to-do list, but I'm not doing it. Oh, and I have it to clean. Ooh, I'll use that instead, because it's really pretty. If I can get this off, I'll use it anyway. Yeah, there we go. So I get for not paying more attention to my kits, you guys. I overlook things. And this is just too pretty to overlook. It's got the flag and it's got that really nice um, reclaimed wood look in the background. So it's absolutely beautiful. And then I can just cover that back up. Perfect. All right, so. Let me do my flags really quick so I can see. Ooh, they are really big. Really, really big. I can cut them down though. How much do I need to cut? Probably that much on this side. Um, and. You can't even see what I'm doing. I'm just giving that a little slice. Let's see how that looks. Okay. Cut my flag down a little here and see if I can make it whoops, fit a little bit better. Perfect. And then I will just cut the top off here. Hope I'm not cutting my planner. Okay, good. Alright. And then... Same thing with this side. I'll have to cut it down a little bit. But at least I know what I'm doing now. So let me go ahead and just cut a little bit here. And a little bit here. And then we'll lay that down. Awesome. Cut my edge off. And you can't see. I have to do it the other way. Okay. That is done. 
and then I want to mark, I haven't decided if I'm going to do my date covers or not. I ripped my paper a little bit there, but I do want to go ahead and put down, oh, uh, that's rose gold. I don't know. I'm not going to do that today. Do I want to do the date covers? Let me see what it looks like. Cause then it won't cover, or it'll cover up the hideousness of how I kind of went up over the numbers. So I think I will Tuesday. All right, you guys. Uh, I don't think they look right. I'm just gonna leave it as is. Gonna leave it, y'all. I really suck at putting kit, uh, stickers back on their pages. Okay, so put that away. I didn't use that. Um, I have a better sticker for my laundry that I want to use to mark. So I have... These are from Planner Studio. It's called Mimi. M-I apostrophe M-E. I'll let you take a look at that. Come on, there we go. They are super cute. Small enough to work perfectly in my planner with the checklists. Alright, so we'll put that one here to make sure I do my laundry. And then, I don't know if I have any... I do have dinners. Okay, so let me mark my dinners really quick. Um, so, Thursday, Friday, Sunday is my meal strategy here. Alright, so I'm going to use this really bright red one and stick it up here for Thursday. I don't care if I cut off a little bit of the full box. Because I gotta have room. Hopefully I won't get any mail that day. <laughs> so and then we'll use this nice dark blue and stick it here. Okay, and then on Sunday I'll do light blue and I'll put it up here. Okay, I think that is everything. Let me organize the chaos here so I can show you everything. I'll put this here. These are all the things I used. Gathering all the things for you guys so you can see all the shops used and I will make sure that I link them all down below just like I always do um, so you know um, who the shops are I did not end up using any of my large washi oh I gotta put my weekend banner down you guys no no I guess I'm gonna stick it across here or, you know I'll put it down at the bottom just because I kind of took up all the space I took up all the space and it's black and white so it'll still Look really nice and it'll stick out. Oh, look at that. Okay. Ooh, -wee, I love it. I love it. Now if I can just get it straight. There we go. All right, there's my weekend banner. Okay, you guys, let me move. Again, let me say, let me move, move these out of the way since I didn't use them. And I will open up everything so you can see the spread. Alright you guys, so there is my July spread, um, I do, that's gold, never mind, I said I was going to mark my days off, but they're, the stickers I have for them are gold. Alright, so, this is my 4th of July kit by Shop Jessica Hearts, it's called Americana, it's for the week of July 2nd to July 8th, let me, alright you guys, I'm back, sorry about that, dogs and whatnot. So let me just show you real quick what I have left of the kit. So on this one here, all I have left is some headers and a couple of half boxes. I probably will end up using those throughout the week. Um, I have most of this page left. I have a small flag. I have all my date covers. I have my um, Monday through Sunday sheets, um, icons, most of my little things, quarter boxes, and 
icons. I don't have any of my pool boxes left. I have a couple of the glitter headers, more quarter boxes and flags and checklists. I have most of my ombre heart checklist left and there is my washi strips. Thank you again so much for watching you guys. I really appreciate it. I hope you like and subscribe down below. Again, my name is April and I am Pugged and Crafty. Have a great day. Bye.